Hello guys, welcome back to another video. My name is Elena and this is my YouTube channel. Welcome back or welcome if you are new. Um, I post every Friday and um, occasionally Wednesday, so you should definitely subscribe down below. This video is just going to be a Q&A basically because I've been on YouTube for one year now. That's insane. It's been officially like one year since I, since I made my YouTube channel. Not since I first made, posted my first video. But since I made my YouTube channel, because I made my YouTube channel on February 2nd of 2019, and it's now, I don't know what day this video is going up, but right now it's February 1st, and tomorrow is my one year anniversary. So I decided, why not do a Q&A, because that seems like a good thing to do when it's your one year anniversary on YouTube. So I asked you guys some questions on Instagram, um, just to ask me anything, so I'm going to answer those questions today. Um, you should also go follow my Instagram so you can participate when I do things like this and ask you guys questions. Let's get straight into the video. <laughs> okay, so I got your guys' Instagram questions. I'm going to answer them. I'm also going to answer some ones from a questionnaire thing I did a while back just to add some to the video. Why did you start YouTube? I started YouTube originally just to um, work on editing because I absolutely love making videos. I've been making videos since I was like so little. Um, and I would always just make them for fun but never do anything with them and so I realized hey I can like put them on YouTube. Um, so that's pretty much why just because I wanted more people to see um, my videos that I just liked making in the first place. How do you feel about being on YouTube for one year? What is your favorite video you've made? Um, it doesn't really feel like anything. I mean, I definitely feel happy about it. Um, I feel happy, successful. I've met so many amazing people. Um, my favorite video I've made... I'm trying to think. <laughs> um, it's probably, um, how to stop caring about what people think just because it actually ended up reaching a lot of people and a lot of people liked it and I had fun making it because I struggled with that and to get to get to know that I helped other people and to see you guys' comments saying like that helped you so much that means so much to me. What is your favorite candy? My favorite candy is Lindor truffles. Um, I don't know if you know what they are, but they're these little chocolate things that have like this chocolate mousse inside of them. They're so good. They're literally amazing. Do you have any major hobbies? I mean, YouTube, um, filming, editing. Um, I like reading. I just don't have the time for it. I like to dance and that's pretty much it. What is the most stressful thing about YouTube? Probably having a posting schedule just because, you know, you want to try and post consistently, but you know, you also have a life at the same time. I'm a sophomore in high school. I do dance. Um, I have a lot going on to, you know, also do YouTube. So I guess that's the most stressful thing is trying to post consistently because you know, it's going to get your channel to grow. But at the same time, it's so freaking complicated. My favorite movie. My favorite movie right now is Rise of Skywalker, um, Star Wars, and also, I mean, if we just want to go franchises, my favorite movie franchise is one, Star Wars, and two, Harry Potter. Those are my two favorites. How long have you been dancing? I've been dancing for two years now. I think it's been two years now. Not counting, like, the years I had when I was, like, six because I did dance when I was younger, then I stopped, and I did gymnastics for five years, and now we're dancing again. <laughs> Favorite YouTubers? Um, my life is Ava, um, who's also Vlogtowski, which is where I literally got my freaking inspiration to make videos and like make cinematic videos. Um, I also like Smosh, they're funny. Good Mythical Mornings, pretty good. Um, yeah, that's all I can think of right now. What is a lesson making YouTube videos taught you? That not everything is what it seems. <laughs> I know that sounds really weird, but it's like, you know, you watch YouTube videos, you see people making YouTube videos, you watch them on YouTube, but when you actually start doing it yourself, you kind of realize like, oh, this is kind of, this is more complicated than it really looks, you know? They make it look so easy and so flawless, which is amazing because, you know, if something's really good, it should look flawless um, and not there. But once you do it yourself, you're like, oh, this is a bit more complicated, but it's still fun. What is my favorite part about being an, a YouTuber? Definitely you guys because you guys are literally so sweet and so amazing and getting to you know, talk to you guys and meet you guys um, 
not like face to face but like you know meet you guys through the internet and like watch your guys youtube channels and connect with you guys and help you guys it's, it's just amazing it's such an amazing community i'm so happy that i'm a part of it favorite bible verse um i mean i definitely like um love the lord your god with all your heart with all your soul with all your mind all your strength matthew 10 10 30 if that's wrong i'll put it up on the screen and then i also love the one i have on my wall back here which is the fruit of the spirit is love joy peace patience kindness um goodness faithfulness gentleness and self-control and that is galatians 5 22 to 30 23 and then my third favorite bible verse oh my gosh my third favorite bible verse um i don't remember like the exact wording of it but it's basically saying um like be slow to rise to anger because like if it's basically saying if you start yelling um you're gonna get angry really fast people are gonna get angry but if you just you have like a soft tune and you just like are peaceful and gentle it's gonna deflate anger i don't know the exact verse if you were an animal what would you be a flamingo it's not even a question okay flamingos are actually my favorite animal and i would love to be a flamingo just because they're so pretty and like graceful and different and i love them what makes you want to go further now i don't know really know what this like question means but i'm gonna answer it how i interpret it um on just like what keeps me motivated i think just the fact that i like making videos <laughs> keeps me motivated and the fact that i have complete creative control over everything i do and I can, you know, make it whatever I want to. And I know that people will be there to support me no matter what. Um, that's what pretty much keeps me going. What do you think of the YouTube community? I kind of answered this already. But I mean, I think some parts of it are definitely toxic. But if you stay away from those parts, it's a pretty pretty good platform. Pretty, pretty good community. Um, if you know how to find the right people. So, yeah. Thank you guys so so much for watching this video um i hope you guys enjoyed learning a bit more about me this is the first q and a q and a i've ever done make sure to subscribe down below and turn on the notifications so you can see when i post first i usually post on fridays and sometimes wednesdays if i happen to get a video done and yeah i will see you guys in the next one bye have an amazing day